Hi, it's Wesley with Expandacraft here. I am the uh, inventor, the, the designer, and manufacturer of Expandacraft. I'm going to show you a little bit about the parts and tell you a little bit how we use these hull parts to make outrigger kits and regular boats. Now, this is the center hull part. Uh, right here, it is from this measurement here to here, is four feet. So if you put them together, when it goes down this joint, it's four foot, four foot, four foot, and this is a little bit longer than four feet. So in this particular instance, with the bow, two sections, and the stern, you end up with a 12 foot, nine inch hull. Now I'm using this one on this particular canoe. It's an old canoe with a new Expand the Craft Outrigger kit. And uh, if you follow us on uh, YouTube, then you'll get to see the building of this as we go. We're going to make how-to videos. And so follow that. We've got lots of neat techniques. Now, this is 11 pounds uh, for the center hull part. From the bow section is seven and a half pounds. Now, this joinery, I made this joinery. I designed this after thinking I had a dream kind of thing about the coupling of a railroad car. And so I did this coupling, one this way and one this way. This allows the parts to connect to one another, but at the same time, it allows um, the bow to connect to a bow, a bow, a bow. Um, it's interchangeable. Now I'll show you how these work. You simply have a wood peg that you pull out. I make these by hand. This is hand laid, and out it comes. So it's seven and a half pounds for the bow part. And of course, when it goes back together, um, insert that pin, and presto. All right, now, let's see uh, what's on my cheat sheet over here, the joint. Um, okay, now you can buy your Expandacraft parts individually and just make your own thing. Uh, if you look here, this is the risers. Now the risers connect here. There's a little piece of PVC that goes in here to keep your compression uh, from squeezing the part. And this riser brings it up so that you can use this aluminum cross tube. Uh, that's when you're using it for outriggers or if you're using just the uh, expander craft hulls in um, catamaran or trimaran uh, form, you've got that. Now come over here, I'll show you this. This is a standard paddle cat. It's kind of like the replacement um, of a kayak style sit on top. This thing will break down in less than a minute. It actually breaks down in less than a minute and it can go in the back of a, a small car. This one's been in my rental fleet for years. Now decking is a little interesting. Here this one has a six foot aluminum deck. This one is a homemade lattice wood deck with a stadium seat on it and this one is a folding and this is a marine grade plastic and it has a uh, kayak style seat which will connect here with the hooks um, but this will fold up to four feet during transport this one's also been in my rental fleet for some time but that can fit in your trunk, zip, bam, boom, and uh, you're ready to go. Now, let me see what else is on my list. Oh, um, this is the 12-footer over here. Now, the 12-foot outrigger kit, I put six-foot deck planks, but you can see the overhang here. It overhangs a good bit. While on the eight-foot deck plank, it only overhangs just a little. So again, it's a modular boat. You get to do whatever you want to with Expand the Craft. So um, let's see, don't forget to subscribe and um, make sure that you view as many of the videos on YouTube before you uh, call us or, or put your order in to make sure that you realize how many options there are. Because with Expand the Craft, the only limitation is your imagination. ExpandTheCraft.com.